Hi dolls, welcome back to my channel. So today's video, I am going to be creating this easy, colorful makeup look using Ace Beauty, the Nostalgic Palette. So this palette right here, let me open it up so you can see what it looked like on the inside. You see all those beautiful colors. And if this is your first time to my channel, hi, my name is Latoya. And if you like beautiful, colorful makeup look like this, low buys, project pants, or just makeup, go ahead and join my YouTube family by clicking on that subscribe button down below. And while you're at it, hit the notification bell so that you'll be alerted anytime I upload a new video. So let's go ahead and jump into this easy, colorful makeup look using this palette right here. All right, dolls, so let's jump into this look. You know I like to have my brows already done. So I'm taking this first color, which is raspberry, and packing that onto the outer corner of my lid. All right, so the blending brush that I'm using is like a tapered blending brush, and I'm just packing that color right into the outer corner of my lid. And then I'm taking a small detail blending brush, and I'm going in with flip-flops, and I'm just gonna kind of blend that on the outer corner of raspberry, and also bringing it up into my crease. Any brushes that I use in this video, I will make sure that I put it down below in the description box so you know exactly which brush that I'm using. So at this point, I'm taking Picnic and a larger fluffy blending brush and kind of packing it into my lid. If I were to do this look again, I would actually take more of a like a packing brush or maybe a shadow brush to um, apply Picnic onto my lid. This fluffy brush that I used here, I end up having to keep going back and forth because I really didn't use the proper brush for this method, but it, it worked, it turned out. So now I'm going back with that small blender brush that I used before and I'm going to take flip flops and I'm just kind of blending in between raspberry and picnic to kind of diffuse and blend those two shades together so it won't go from like that berry purple to the pink it will actually have some type of transition now at this point i'm just kind of like going back and forth between my colors and now i'm taking beach and applying that onto my brow bone just to have like a skin tone shadow on my lid so that when i blend the other colors up it blends into like a skin tone look Now I'm taking a detailed detailing angled brush and I'm going in with raspberry. I'm just gonna apply that along my lash line. And now I'm gonna take this same small blending brush with um, flip flops and I'm just blending out that purple. Now I'm gonna apply vacation to the inner corner of my lower lash line with a pencil brush. Then I'm gonna take another pencil brush and apply Water Slide, which is that beautiful yellow to the inner corner of my, I guess, teared up area. Now at this point to make a nice transition in between that pink and that yellow, I took this beautiful creamsicle color, which is called Popsicle, and I'm applying that with a small blending brush in between the pink and the yellow. Now this part looks crazy, so I'm not gonna stay on it too long, but I'm gonna apply a white liner in my waterline and then I'm going to apply some mascara on my lower lashes before I apply some lash glue on my top lashes to apply my falsies. So dolls, I know that this is not the best angle of me applying some lashes. However, I do have a video for that. So if you want to check it out, I will put it in the eye. However, I just want to say that this lash glue that I use, I don't remember the name, but I will put it down below in the description box. But this mess had my eyes burning. I'm over here like trying to adjust my lashes and keep my tears from messing up my eye makeup by using my fan. You know, I only use my fan just to set my face, but oh my goodness. I would not recommend using the lash glue that I put down below in the description box. So now I'm just applying some highlighter to my face. The highlighter that I'm using is from my Project Pan. So it is the Jaclyn Hale Trio Palette. And then I'm also applying some highlighter to the inner corner of my lid on top of that yellow, which is water, water slide. And um, the color I used, the highlighter that I used was actually, I believe it was Pearl from that trio. At this point, I'm lining my lips. I am using the Beauty Bakery, not the Booty Bakery, but the Beauty Bakery Sugar Stick Lip Liner in Cream de la Crop. 
And then I am going to go with my Too Faced Liquid Matte Lipstick, and this is in Chihuahua. To complete this look, I am going to set my face with this Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. And y'all, get ready for this transition. Alright dolls, so this is my ending look. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Make sure you leave a comment down below. Thank you dolls for watching, and remember, you are made for more. Bye!